Hello everyone, so I'm doing another journal with me today. Uh, the I'm working in Thick Boy once again in Thick Boy. Um, and right now I'm just gonna grab a couple things from my scraps container. Now I don't end up using uh, that small strip there because it sort of disappears. However, I am gonna use um, that serviette which I got from like a, a cheapy stock shop somewhere in a, in a in one of those shops. You know those like cheap shops that like crazy bargains. I'm not sure what like think Dollar Tree except not everything's a dollar they're kind of pricey actually but you find things there sometimes for cheap um, I'm also going to use a tip and I created I got hiccups for some reason um, now uh, I bought some matte gel medium um, and I try to use it um, but I use it wrong um, I end up uh, trying to glue down the serviette um, to the page like you see people do except I didn't put any glue on the page first so this causes me a hell of a lot of stress and it's entirely my fault it's my fault alone and only my fault um, so I think eventually what I end up doing is I do end up getting very annoyed with it and I am um, I think it breaks at one point and I end up just ripping it off completely yeah there we go I just rip it off completely and I go right glue first there we go see I learned my lesson kind of a little bit maybe kind of not sort of not really because I, I do it again um, <laughs> I don't rip it off again but it, it, it doesn't work out how I planned again um, but that's fine um, so here we go try again round number two I'm just gonna apply some glue some matte gel medium uh, down to the page and that's that I don't go too ham on it um, but at the same time I go very ham on it um, that brand of um, match gel medium by the way it is um, an Australian brand I think uh, a Derivan uh, Matisse match gel medium I will uh, put the, the, the type up on the on the screen you'll see some some words um, it has thick viscosity so maybe that's why I'm having issues with it I'm not sure if there's like a thinner one who knows um, so yeah, I do that, and I think I've added a, a, a bit more, and I, I, I'm really trying here to sort of get it to stick, but I end up just ripping that part there off. Um, and what am I doing here now? I'm doing something. I have no idea what I'm doing right now, because I don't remember what I did in what order. Uh, I think I'm grabbing, uh, no, no, I've just gone and taken it to my hairdryer, I think, yes, I just went and took it to my hairdryer. Um, and now I'm going to add a bit more glue down because I think I'm going to add I'm going to add another bit of a, a bit of that serviette. Now it's like a white serviette with like silver polka dot things on it. They kind of shine sometimes, but I think I've put it upside down so you don't get the shiny effect. And or the matte gel medium has got rid of the shiny effect. Who knows? Now instead of tr trying to put glue on top of this, I literally just start gluing things down. Now that piece there is from a scrap uh, pad. Um, it's not that one. I don't know where it is. It's here somewhere. I'll put it up on the screen. You'll see it. Um, I haven't done that part of the editing yet. Um, I got it from Crazy Cat, Kayser Craft, and it's a scrap from the last uh, spread. Which, mind you, I didn't record the last spread, and I'm glad I didn't because it ended up being hellish. Um, you'll see when I eventually do a flip through, flip through of this journal, I'll, 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 I'll mention it because it was it was hellish. Um, I end up ripping off uh, the corner of that dictionary paper there and I'm just gonna glue that down quite nicely just like that so it, it worked it worked for me um, and I think I literally just took that I have no idea what I just did just there. I actually just picked it up for some reason and now I'm gonna add a bit more um, serviettes um, one issue I was having is I was trying to be perfectionist like you'll notice I'm like I'm really trying to get that exactly where I want it and I'm not a perfectionist and I've never been the perfectionist so that was a bad mistake in my part I'm a messy person, it's why I like the idea of junk journaling and, and just mixed media because it's it's such a messy art that I sort of feel like anyone can do, you know? Now here I'm, I've grabbed some uh, spearmint, it's Kayser Craft colour, it's in the spearmint, uh, and I, I really like this colour, and I, I grabbed some white paint finally, I finally have some white paint, and it's just a need is all purpose acrylic craft paint. Um, I'm going to mix the two together because yes spearmint's a light colour, but I sort of wanted a bit lighter. Um, for what I wanted so it wasn't working so I just put some more white paint directly into it and it came out slightly lighter and I was happy with that um, it actually turned out that the color of the um, 
for the light blue color that I used. It sort of semi matches the light blue on the tip in. The guitar is actually a lightish blue. I mean, it matches. Um, with that paint, I'm really just going to just draw straight lines down. That's it. That's all I'm going to do. Um, I wanted this to be simple because the last run I did really did cause me a lot of stress and I spent hours on it simply because I just couldn't get anything I wanted to do to work. Um, absolutely nothing worked on it. Um, so, and I, I just sort of moved on and tried my best with it and that was that. Um, now I ended up using a paper towel there to sort of smudge up the rest of the paint and spread a lot all over the, the egg uh, carton lid. Um, and that's because I want to use um, serviettes in my journal. If I don't do a junk journal or anything like that, I want to use colourful serviettes. It's completely inspired by Shannon Green. Um, so that's what I want to do. Now I think I'm, I think I'm tidying up. I'm doing something. I'm no, no idea what I'm doing right now. Um, I think, yeah, there you go. I've grabbed some washi tape um, and I've air dried it. Um, fun fact, when I grabbed that washi tape, all of my washi tape went everywhere. So that's something that happened. Now this is a tip in that I created from a Frankie magazine image and a bit of ephemera that I wasn't going to use, so I just sort of stuck it on there. Um, and I've also got some light blue or pastel blue uh, washi tape to sort of stick it down. Um, and so it ends up it ends up working quite well with each other. I quite like it. Um, I think I think this spread's quite simplistic and I enjoy it a lot. Um, now, right about now, I have just disappeared to go and grab some stamps. Now this stamps, again, is going to be very simple, I'm not going to use that circle date or anything like that. I'm literally just going to grab some stays on and a date stamp and I'm just going to date today, which is April 1st. Um, but that is this video over. Thank you for watching. Here are some photos. Enjoy.